love that you're still in, you got the red sweater on. I got to ask you, first of all, just about the sweater, because a lot of people have asked me about it. Uh, it's gotten so many comments online as your question did. How did you choose to wear it last night? Well, Anderson, I don't think that your producers would have let me on the show if I didn't <laughs> promise to wear the sweater. Uh, but uh, thank you so much for having me on. Uh, the reason why I went with the red sweater uh, is uh, I, w I had a very lovely olive-colored suit that I was going to wear that my grandfather helped me to pick out before he passed away. And I thought, man, that'd be great. I'm going to be on national TV. I can wear uh, Grandpa's favorite suit. But apparently, since he passed away, I've gained about 30 pounds. And when I got into my car to leave for the debate venue, I tore the seat out of the pants oh, no. of that suit and had to do an emergency switch to what is normally <laughs> a Christmas sweater. Well, it works. I, 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 there were signs outside the debate hall saying Bone 2016 for president. People talking about Halloween costumes in your name. Does it feel strange to sort of become an overnight sensation? Uh, it's been very strange, and uh, I'm very sorry to all the uh, Ken Bone 2016 people, but I am only 34 years old. Uh, you'll have to wait for <laughs> Ken Bone 2020. Uh, and if you want to dress as me for Halloween, you better be quick. This sweater is sold out on Amazon, and these mustaches don't come overnight. Um, I want to read just a couple more tweets. One saying, Kenneth Bone, sorry, I can't think about anything else tonight. The debate is whatever, uh, whatever now. Kenneth Bone, Kenneth Bone, Kenneth Bone. Another, Kenneth Bone is real, and he's strong, and he's my friend. And take me to the Kenneth Bone zone. Um, I, uh, trending on social media, has, has it won you some points? I know you have a 12-year-old son, Logan. Does he think you're pretty cool tonight? Uh, yes. Well, it's Columbus Day today, so he had the day off of school. So today, having Internet famous dad is the greatest thing ever. Uh, tomorrow, when he has to go in and talk to his friends, maybe he'll change his mind. But <laughs> just to be cool in the eyes of your preteen son is uh, worth this whole thing. Well, um, first of all, uh, as I said to all the participants last night, but I met with you all before the debate, I, I, you know, to, to, to put the time in that you put in to come up with your question, uh, to spend the day there, it's not an easy thing to stand on that stage, ask a question. I'm so glad we got yours in. I wish we got more in.